Everybody Walk is our campaign. As you can see, we actually have a caterpillar back here who walks. As nice and fun as it is, it's actually a really serious thing. Diabetes is on the loose. Heart disease is on the loose. We have people who are more overweight than ever before. The idea is simple. Just get up and start walking. In the last couple of years, I've really turned myself around as far as health and activity go. And I lost about 60 pounds. And because I'm such an avid walker, I got chosen to walk with the Kaiser Float. From what I understand, my doctor nominated me. I have arthritis and I've had it since I was three. I don't remember life without arthritis. She always wants to be a firefighter. And uh, when she was uh, uh, in the hospital, I told her you will, you will not only be a firefighter, but also a cancer fighter. So, so then she said, yes, uh, Grace will be a cancer fighter. We'll all walk at separate times of the day. And on certain days, when we get lucky enough, we're able to go for a lunch sort of run walk. And so that's kind of what we've been doing for, for some time. And it's been really fun. Yeah, I asked. Andrea, if she'd be interested in, in walking with me to represent Baldwin Park, if we could get on. And then when they let it be three, we're like, yay, all three of us can go. <laughs> I've lost a lot of weight. I lost almost 70 pounds. I just started walking. For chemo, I had three days a week, one week, and then one day a week the next week. My back was losing muscle strength, and I'd go for walks and stretch it out, and it'd feel a lot better. I like this theme because if all these kids can walk and be active than really anybody can. Not only do we have these incredible people sitting on the float, we have all these doctors who have decided that they are committed to changing themselves. They're walking with the parade. We got people walking five and a half miles here who weren't walking a year ago. The biggest motivator of all was actually a family tragedy. My brother, who was pretty obese, just didn't wake up one morning. And they say he had a heart attack. He was only in his 40s. But I started to think, wow, I could be next. When you have arthritis, you kind of have to use your joints or you lose them. Because if you just sit down and you kind of give up, your joints are going to get stiff and then pretty soon you won't be able to walk. There's some great stories here of patients who have overcome a lot of health issues and used walking and physical activity as a means to improve. And then the physicians and support staff and people who really believe in the message of everybody walk. You're supposed to do the princess way. So. <laughs> so I've been practicing. I'm going to wave to everybody. We have been practicing our wave during oh, our yeah. walks at work. Is, yes. So, yeah. right, to the people driving, driving <laughs> on the street, we'll pra be practicing our wave. For me, it's a little personal. As a member of a minority community, the health risk and comorbidities, the diabetes, hypertension, those kinds of things that are so evident in, in my community um, need to be addressed. And a real easy, inexpensive way to do it is to be up and walking. So that's why everybody walk means so much to me, because I would really like to see every community a healthy community. Kaiser's message is going out loud and clear. Everybody walk. Get up and get moving. Come on, walk with me. I walk the Rose Parade. Get out and walk. I walked the Rose Parade. Get up and get moving. We, we walked, walked the Rose Parade. parade.